Hi everyone, I'm here to do another very quick unboxing. I have my glamorous assistant Rusty here with me as well. Just uh, taking a bit of a nap because it's quite warm today, isn't it? Hey? So the reason I've got Rusty just at the side of me is because this box is actually for him. Um, so it is my meow, which is a monthly box for cats. So it includes five or more items valued at over £40, including treats, toys and surprises, as well as the famous scratch box, which I will of course be showing you as well. So what you can also do when you sign up for this box is tell them your cat's name, their age, their preferences, if they have any allergies or anything like that, and they will try and make sure that it's tailored to them as much as possible. But we'll get into it. He's looking quite interested now. He's quite interested. Well, he's, he's sort of torn between interested and super. Um, so, we have. <laughs> um, so, should we, should we have a look? Okay, let's have a look. So, there's usually a theme every month as well. So, it's okay. And the theme this month is Tropicat. Um, so, there's usually, yeah, so there's um, some information about the products that are inside so I'll just place this off to the side here just so that I can refer to it as I'm going along and then if I just without hitting my cat in the head there is the inside very briefly so I'm going to move it up just a little bit just so it's not blocking the camera and so that Rusty can have what he is doing having a sniff <laughs> what is it you want to do this one first? Okay, so the first thing we have is this Toucan Melody Chaser, which has a obviously some nice feathered tail, very realistic appearance, and it, it does make a noise. You do have to pull it off the actual cardboard before you can hear the noise, um, so I won't be able to play that for you on camera. Um, but it's designed to stimulate and satisfy your cat's hunting skills, particularly if they're an indoor cat. Rusty isn't actually an indoor cat, um, but he has been spending more time indoors um, as he's got older. There he is. Um, and also keep them entertained uh, as well, which it does. Are you having a sniff? Um, so yeah, it's a motion activated sound chip toy. So obviously they... <laughs> he's found something he's very interested in. Yeah, we'll have a look. We'll have a look. Um, so it's motion activated, so it obviously catches your cat's attention as it walks past, it'll move and make noises. So that's the first item. And then this is the one that Rusty was kind of very interested in. What's this? What's this? So this is the Flamingo Finger Teaser. So this is a fun and interactive toy designed specially for fun loving cats. So there's unpredictable movements and obviously bells that make noise that instantly grab your cat's attention just as it's doing with Rusty here. <laughs> um, stimulating them physically and mentally as well as encouraging those natural predatory behaviours as well. Yeah, there we go. Oh, we are very interested. So obviously it has a little loop here for you to um, put around your finger. Does it pull out? No, it's just elasticated. But again, really bright colours, lots of feathers, lots of different textures for him to he like that one. He does like that one, okay. Um, and I have a feeling yeah, he's going to really like this one. <laughs> um, I think it's also, yeah, so it's filled with catnip too, which to be fair, Rusty isn't normally all that bothered about. Um, but I think it's probably, you can probably still smell it and he loves anything that makes a noise as well. Anything that you can chase, don't you? Yeah. So that's item number two. Hi. Hi, baby. Um, so the next item is quite different. So he's obviously chasing this one. <laughs> Do we like that? Hey? Do we like that one? He's purring. Which is the first time he's done that on an unboxing. <laughs> so I'll just show you. He's uh, currently sniffing around the, the, the toys. So I'll continue showing it. You're sitting on my, you're sitting on it. <laughs> so the next item, I'm not sure of the brand here. I think it's Crystalinas. And this is an odour eliminator. So this is actually not specifically for the cat. 
This is a reed diffuser and it lasts for over four weeks. It's, got, it's alcohol free and it has a nice fragrance for odour elimination for pet owners. So basically, obviously if you have a, a dog, cat, any, any pet that you know can, can leave a few little smells around as cute as they are, um, you can use this reed diffuser and, um, and that will help to, to eliminate the, the smells. He's picked the flamingo up, he's rubbing around it, he loves it. He's loving this. Oh dear. Oh, are we rolling around with that? Huh? Are we rolling around with it? Yeah? We are. Okay. So, we now have a couple of snacks, as they always send. So, I think he's had something similar to this before. I'm not sure if he's had this exact flavour, but he's definitely had something similar. Um, and these are Webox Tasty Sticks, but they're salmon and trout. So, they're obviously um, serrated edge, so you can get one out and I think there's one, two, three, four, five, six of them. So obviously um, a few different uh, helpings of it. He's absolutely loving. There we go. I'll just show you him playing with that one. Um, but these are perfect to feed at any time as a tasty chewable snack or treat. They're gently cooked to produce a delicious, moist and meaty treat. I think he's had chicken ones of these before and he did like them. Um, so hopefully he'll like the, the salmon and trout ones as well. Do we like that toy? Do we like it? We do. We do like it. He's all surrounded with his treats now. He's loving them. So we have another like, a lot of treats. Again, these he's had before, um, but he does like them. So these are duck fillet mini strips by Rosewood. And these are made with 100% natural, delicately roasted duck breasts. And they are tasty and gluten free, um, low in fat. So perfect treats for your cat. Um, he's had chicken ones of these before, he's had beef I think, I'm not sure if he's had the duck, he may have had the duck, um, but he did like the chicken ones, so hopefully it will be the same with the duck. Now what we also have in here, I'm not sure how he's going to react to this, so we'll see. What's this? What's this? Is a cardboard tunnel. So we've had one of these before, I think it was Halloween, um, we had one, and obviously you pull it out, um, it's like tropical print um, and they can run through it they can hide and do all sorts of stuff i dare not open this because we're on a bed so um he's <laughs> he's likely to uh, be quite interested but obviously you just open it out like that and they can run through it and do what they want to do and it obviously folds away nice and compact for you to store when they're not using it and then as i mentioned at the very start, if I just remove the sleeve, there is a cat scratch box. What's these? And he's gone. <laughs> Bye. He's gone. Um, but he definitely likes these. I'll try and get a few pictures of him playing with them later. Uh, I usually manage to, to get them. Once I bring them down and we take all the um, you know, the cardboard and, and packaging off them, you usually kind of get stuck in straight away, really. Uh, but as I was mentioning, this is the cat scratch. So this is in the bottom of every box and it's something for them to scratch on, sharpen their nails. There's also a little hole in there for them to poke the little paws through if they want to as well. And um, what cat doesn't like sitting in boxes? I mean, you know, I, I've never met a cat that doesn't like sitting in boxes. Um, so he's just um, kind of wandered off now, but we at least got him on camera to uh, to play with some of the uh, play with some of the toys. So in terms of the price points for this box, it's really simple price and structure. So it's twenty two pounds ninety per month with free shipping, and it usually ships out no later than the twenty fifth of the month. Obviously, I've got it a little bit earlier, um, just so I can show you guys what's in it. But if you have a cat or cats. Um, or even you know some other animals. I mean, we, we have a I say we. I don't actually live here. This is my mum's house, but um, my mum has an indoor rabbit um, who lives just down the hallway that way, um, and he's actually got a lot of use out of some of the toys as well when he comes down to uh, when he comes down to the living room. So even you know other animals that aren't cats can get a lot of use out of some of the items inside. So I will just very quickly uh, talk you through the items one more time and then I will let you all get on with your Sunday afternoon. So as I showed you just a few seconds ago, there's the cat scratch in the bottom of the box. That's in every month. And I'll just pop the sleeve back in there just so I can pack everything away 
to put things away. We then had the cardboard tunnel, which is all printed in tropical print and it folds away for easier storage. We had the duck fillet mini strips by Rosewood and the Webox tasty sticks in salmon and trout flavour. There was the Crystallina's, I think that's the brand, um, yeah, Crystallina's odour absorber, uh, like weed diffuser. And then the two toys, one of which Rusty was going crazy for, in fact he's licked it so it's all wet. <laughs> Uh, but there was the Flamingo Finger Teaser, which is the one that he was really interested in, and the Toucan Melody Chaser. So, once again, the theme was Tropicat, and as I mentioned, the price is £22.90 for five or more treats for your cat or cats. So, that's everything that I was going to show you. Rusty's disappeared, so I can't bring him on camera to say bye. Um, but you will have seen him earlier, and this video will be going on YouTube, as it always is, so you can always watch it back and uh, see him there too. Any questions, as always, please do post them in the comments, and I'll answer any. Um, and I'll also pop the link to the website in there as well for you. The review that I'm going to be writing for this box, as I do all the time, um, will be up in around a week's time once... Obviously, Rusty's had a chance to, to try out some of the treats and the toys that are in the box. Although I have a feeling I already know what his favourite is, just from his reaction so far. Uh, but as I say, any questions, let me know. And thank you very much for watching. Enjoy your Sunday afternoon and I'll see you all very soon. Bye.